Hi guys, this is Mary with Isru, and today's video is all about this new sticker book that I created, and it's the sticker book that can be used on a split screen on your iPad. And so um, what I found was that it was really difficult for me to add my stickers into my digital planners um, when it was a full sheet and because I would always use a split screen to kind of copy and paste them over. And so I created a split screen sized um, sticker book for you guys to add in your favorite stickers and make it super easy and productive and fast for you to, to do this. Um, so I'm so excited to share it with you. Let's get to it. Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to add stickers to a digital sticker book and keep them organized for easy planning. This um, sticker book that I'm showing here is the split screen sticker book um, that I created for, um, for planning while using split screens. So you'll have your planner on one side and have your sticker book on the other side because it's super annoying you know, to have um, you know, a whole page full of stickers and not be able to see them and have to scroll through them. So I made this slim sticker book so that you can see all your stickers all at once while you're planning on the other side. And um, with this sticker book there are two different sizes to it. There's a portrait size so that you can plan um, and use it while you're planning portrait or there's also a landscape version um, which you can use it this way and I'll show you both versions of it. Uh, so let me show you um, how to put your stickers in and then how you can use it to plan. Um, let's see, we'll use that planner. So this is the portrait uh, version of the, the sticker book. So what you want to do when you're adding stickers to this is you want to do a split screen. You want to open up your stickers, and when you do the split screen, it will actually fit perfectly within the split screen. And so this book has um, tabs where you can customize sections of your stickers, create different categories for them. This index page allows you to write out what you want um, for each section. Maybe this is where you keep all your sticky notes. Maybe this one's icons. Maybe this one's labels. And th these are like your favorites. Maybe you want to do it by color. However you want, you can label it here. And go over to your stickers here. And let's say you want, you just lasso it, copy it, paste it into here. And So now you can organize all of your stickers into your one album here. And for icons, you can even do more than one at a time. You can select a whole group of them, copy paste. You can just select your favorite ones that you use most. For labels, let's say you wanted this whole column here. Now you have a file with all these separate stickers here that you can use in your planner um, anytime you want. And if you wanted to create multiple pages um, in your sticker book, I'll show you how to do that. This page actually, you see these little notches, they indicate what section you're in. So if you want to add more pages to this first section, you want to copy this page. So you pressed copy and you go to this section and you uh, paste, you add page after 
paste page. And so now it's pasted the page right after. So there are two pages here. And if you have things on this page, you can just delete what is here. And you'll have a fresh, a fresh page under this section. So that's how you would add more pages to your sticker book. So we've been working in the portrait view for a while now, and I wanted to show you the, the other landscape version of this um, sticker book. So I'm going to X out of here and open up the landscape version and split screen with the stickers and for this one, you'll notice that you'll notice that it fits perfectly within the landscape um, split screen. So what I want to show you here now is how to label your um, custom areas here within these sections, and also label your tabs on every single page. Um, and this actually needs to be labeled on every page because it actually won't copy over um, automatically. So you'll have to manually do that and I'll show you how to do that now. this over to each label and I'll have to do this on every page so I want to copy it after I rotate it and I have it the exact size that I want I want to copy it and paste it over to every page in the planner So now that you have your labels done, you can um, start using your stickers inside your planner. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So this is the planner that I'm going to be showing you. Um, it's super easy to add these stickers right directly into your planner in this view because you have this whole left side which is really large for you to bring up any page that you like. Maybe you want to um, put it into one of your weekly spreads here and you want to add a sticky note to it. You just grab the sticky note that you want 
and paste it in here. It's super simple. The transparencies will remain because this is a transparent um, image. And you can even add more stickers to your planner if, if you want a bulleted list here, you can do that. But now you can see kind of how simple it is to use your sticker book side by side with your planner as you're planning. Uh, let's say in your calendar you're flying out this day. You can add that. And let's say you've got assignment due this day. You can easily add that. And uh, let's see some labels. Say you're taking a vacation here. So you can see it's super easy to move it around. Let's say your vacation shifts. Uh, you can just change it. And that's how you plan side by side with your split screen sticker book. Super easy, much better than scrolling all over the place looking for your stickers. This is a really convenient and easy way to see all of your stickers all in one place. You can and that's it. If you're new to digital planning and want to give this a try, I'll leave links to free digital planning stickers um, below and free digital planners for you to test out. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have any questions or comments, you can leave them below. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this.